Yes, my dear student, now the soil pollution or land pollution. Soil pollution or land pollution is mainly caused by the pesticide, herbicide, weedicide, fertilizers, industrial waste, fungicides and effect of all these the pH of soil is not maintained and fertility decreases. Insecticide you know very well, insecticide also chemicals insecticide where the word side come it means to kill insecticide the chemicals used to kill the insect like as pest hubs and weedicide and we are using a lot of fertilizers to get more crops that also disturbing the soil pH is not maintained sun is not coming properly so in this way The land pollution is mainly caused by pesticides which are used to kill or stop the reproductive process of the unwanted organism. But use of pesticides have harmful effect health of man through contaminated food and water we are getting. And now the strategy for the control of environmental pollution. Number one is that the management of the waste material for control of the environmental solution should be done by number one recycling. Many of the waste materials, many of the waste materials can be recycled by collection and recycling of glass, use of scrap metals in manufacture of uh, steel. Combustible waste can be burned to get energy. So this is what the recycling, three steps. And then sewage treatment, the sewage treatment the sewage disposal can be treated by number one removal of solid water organic matter can oxidized or decreased by applying physical and chemical processes like coagulation filtration and disinfection by bleaching powder then third is incineration it is the conversion of it is the conversion of organic material to co2 organic material to CO2 and water at 1000 degree centigrade in excess of air. It is used to destroy household waste and biological waste from hospitals that is called incineration. Then digestion it is the process of degradation of waste by the microorganisms in the absence of oxygen. It is also called anaerobic digestion in which you can give the example 2HCHO gives you CO2 and methane. Then dumping, controlled dumping of waste in the oceans and soil is a useful practice. However, stock contains nitrogen and phosphorus which act fertilizer to fertilize the land for agriculture. In the next class, we will discuss some important terms like as BOD, eutrophication and a little bit about the green chemistry. Till then, goodbye. Bye-bye.